the one factor is replacing three people. <laughs> um, you know, obviously, Connor Canizero uh, was a big part of our team, uh, you know, a high-scoring team, and uh, that's going to be tough to replace. But we also had, you know, Tyler Pace as a four-year four start at the midfield, and uh, Christian Bergdorf as a first-team All-American defenseman. But uh, we feel like we can. We feel like our depth is there. We feel like our uh, the handful of kids that are going to help us as freshmen is there. And uh, we think our culture of, of winning and our culture of uh, being successful and knowing what it takes to, uh, to get back to that championship weekend is, is built in. What, they, what, Trevor, what people don't really know about Trevor is how humble he is. He is uh, a wonderful person, forgetting that he's a monster on the lacrosse field, but he's a really, truly wonderful teammate, friend, and, and, and person that just, uh, that's just uh, second to none. I think Trevor has changed the position in, in, in that he came from uh, a background of knowledge. He knew what he was doing. And I think the difference between Trevor and a lot of other face-off guys is that he's continued to learn. He's continued to teach young people th that. And most importantly, he stayed in top physical shape. So we see a lot of these guys breaking down their wrists, their shoulders, their hips, their knees. And Trevor uh, has stayed on top of it. And interestingly enough, his goal to be not just a face-off guy has kept him driven to improve on his stick skills and his shooting skills, and I think we'll see a lot of that this year.